Happy Independence Day, everyone. It is your Black Knight wishing you a 4th of July filled with hot dogs and apple pie and fireworks or free of fireworks with an elegant meal and a very nice chablis to go with it. This is Independence Day, after all. There are traditions, yes, but the main tradition is freedom. I was thinking of going into a long dissertation on what freedom is and its value, but no one wants to go there. The main thing you should associate this day of freedom with is the things you love. It could be your family, your home, your job, or something so simple as looking at the fireworks from a hotel in Boston while breaking your father's camera using the bulb function for too long. Yes, that happened. And no, he didn't even get mad. And yes, the pictures were fantastic, taken over three decades ago, and they're in a box somewhere. If I, if I dig those up, we'll, we'll do that for another 4th of July video. You see, it's hard to appreciate freedom. It, it's way too vast a concept. But a hot dog or ketchup and pickle is a very small but concrete thing. That's, a, that's my number one favorite here, followed closely by ketchup with onion or a properly done Texas wiener. There is such a thing as an improperly done Texas wiener, and they are the stuff of nightmares, trust me. Now, without getting too wrapped up in wieners, if you can associate freedom with something you love, like a wiener, and that's not a false association, they are linked, then perhaps you can start to value the mind-boggling concept of what it is to be free. Okay, perhaps that was a short dissertation on freedom. Medium length? I don't know. It was, okay, it was, it was a bit of a freedom ramble, but... At any rate, as you can see, in this video I am driving my American Yuga 4x4 up the side of Mount Sheliad to fire some in-game fireworks from the peak. This is tricky because the, uh, the Yuga 4x4 is actually two-wheel drive. I still don't know why they called it a 4x4 and then made it a two-wheel drive car. And it's, uh, it's, it's a little down on power. This is not the most powerful vehicle. It's just a, a classic custom van. It's, it's not really made for any of this. Uh, it doesn't have tons of power. I did actually have a voiceover that went along with this. Um, spoiler alert, it does get up there eventually. It, uh, it doesn't have a good time with it. I did, I did do a voiceover while I was doing this, but the microphone was glitched out in OBS. Didn't realize it. Wasn't recording anything at all. And, uh, yeah, so all this, this little voiceover is doing, it's getting done after the effect, or it's going to kind of follow along with the video and watch me just spin the tire. Spin the, come on. Come on, this is, this is America. Talk about America here, you gotta get up this hill. It does get up there. It, it does get stuck on trees, though. I mean, you know. Oh, here we go. Falling down to Chiliad, uh. In case you're wondering, this is not a good d vehicle. Not that it shows up in traffic, but if they ever do update the traffic, and you can grab a Yuga 4x4, do, do not take it for a d -friend. Not, not in any way, shape, or form. I was doing this in a public lobby, as you can see from the, the checkpoints there, but no one swooped in and blasted me, so... You have that going for us. Come on. Come on, baby. You can do this. You can do this, you can't do this. So oh, here we go. Yeah. The van the van takes a beating. But it keeps on going, that's You start to slide down in life, you just keep trying to turn it up back up the hill and you keep keep working at it. You know? You'll get there. Come on, here we go. We got a little bit of a ridge. I don't know why the ridges have a little bit more traction to them. At least it seems that way. Yeah, we're off the ridge and now we're just come on, it's so close! Yee! There we go. This gravity. Gravity's a thing. Look, it even has a front differential. The model on this is it has a front differential. Why is this a two-wheel drive car? Rockstar, you gotta get on that. You make the, the 4x4 or 4x4. One of these updates. You, you, you gotta give us that. As you can see, only the back tires are spinning.
I mean, I don't think if you made it a 4x4, it would suddenly make this vehicle OP. You know, I mean, it's not powerful enough to suddenly be, you know, the new leader in vans or something like that, or, you know, it's not going to be a racing force just because you give it four-wheel drive. It's a Yuga. It's not like a Yuga V12 like they have over in Project Homecoming, whatever super fast Yuga they have. Come on. Yeah, we, we found a trail. Come on, baby. You can do this. I know you do can do this because we've already done it. All right. Let's wheel this puppy up the... Uh... You, good, come on. Just a little... At least I've got, you know, I'm cool in there because I've got the door open and more to the point gone. You can see the interior. It's a, it's a very comfy interior, you know. In my mind, it's a comfy interior. Got the American flag all over this. It's such American. And, you know, people, they, they like to get down on that. But, I mean, you know... Again, freedom is such a hard thing to think about, but you can see a flag and you can associate it with the emotion that's, that's so ineffable. You know, it, it's, it's so, so taken for granted, something that unless you've experienced not freedom, it's hard to know what freedom even is, but you know. But yet you, you bathe in it every day if, you, if you've got it. It's just an amazing thing. So we can we attach certain things to it. Being able to play a video game where I'm driving up the hill with, just to shoot up virtual fireworks. That's, you know, that's an amazing thing. I could give you whatever opinion I want on freedom and it's okay. We're almost there. Almost to the top. Come on. I'm not taking the current G Fred uh, line where you just pop up and, and touch the thing. I'm, I'm going all the way up to park. But there you go. I guess if you took the OG route with it, if you got stuck with this, you could take the OG route up up the hill on the on the trails. Maybe that work out. The feeling that one bush is going to get you though. It's a, it's a pretty wide vehicle. Now, if you don't know what a G Fred is, link in the description. And now it's time to get down with our 4th of July selves, folks. Fireworks from the top of Mount Chilead. Ooh. Ah. I just heard a big explosion. It, it turns out that wasn't me. It's While Booper Dooper was firing an RPG. I saved some. You're, you're not going to be able to get them until 4th of July, you know? I think I was trying to say something profound here and then... Let's let's take it back down Chiliad because yeah, you know, the trip down Chiliad can be even more exciting than the ride up. We'll, we'll do that just to, to finish things up. I do hope though that this you know I, I hope and I pray this day finds you at the top of your mountain. With something to celebrate. And if not, don't give up. Just keep driving. You'll get there. Just like we did. Just be way more careful on the way back down. Or, or don't don't come off the top of the mountain. Better off, don't come off the top of the mountain. But here we came off the top of the mountain. This is not the way to come off the top of the mountain. It's a wildly entertaining way if you're not in the van. 
Especially if you're not the man. And through the magic of GTA physics, we're still going. And we're not dead. Not even hurt. I should have jumped out and ridden the uh, the door down. It's so hard to pull that off. I've never done it. The front bumper is sliding down the mountain. Here we go. Luckily, I've got armor on this, so it's not in a real danger of exploding, but losing lots of bits, yeah. Looks like it's making love to the tree. It's snuggling. There's a lot of snuggling going on here. And we're down! So I'll give you a little bit of insight here. You know, from here on, I try to get downtown to go shoot fireworks at people just to get their attention. And that didn't particularly happen in this clip because then the game crashed. So there, there, there was some gameplay after this, but I think for the 4th of July video, that's probably, this is probably where we should leave it. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a happy Independence Day.